The biggest and most complicated portion of the downtown crossing is reconfiguring the Kennedy Interchange. Plans for this section call for improving traffic flow where I-64, I-65, and I-71 converge in downtown Louisville. Let's take a look at the I-65 corridor. This one-mile stretch extends from Muhammad Ali Boulevard to the Ohio River. Crews must build an approach to the new bridge to carry six lanes of northbound traffic. Traffic was shifted in the summer of 2014 to allow new lanes of I-65 South to be built. These new lanes will temporarily carry northbound traffic as crews build new lanes of I-65 North. By building this approach, as well as reconstructing several ramps, many improvements are being made at the street level. Here's where construction is taking place at Market and Jackson Streets. When finished, here's how it will look. You'll notice the gateways created with the addition of monuments and landscaping. Here's the current view of this same overpass from the opposite side where Market Street meets Hancock Street. Once again, enhancements have been made to improve the look of the new overpass and retaining walls. Moving one block north to Main Street, this is the view of construction at the I-65 overpass next to Slugger Field. Significant progress has already been made at this intersection. The artist rendering offers a look at the finished product and highlights the improvements being made. Moving to the I-64, I-71 corridor, more improvements are happening along River Road. This is the corner of River Road and Witherspoon across from the Big Four pedestrian bridge. It will be turned into a plaza, offering pedestrians and bicyclists a spot to stop and take a break. It's one of two plazas that will be added. The other is near Slugger Field at Witherspoon and River Road. Both plazas will feature benches and landscaping. As you can see, building the Kentucky approach to the new bridge will not only improve safety and traffic flow, it also includes several improvements on the streets of downtown Louisville.